Are you suffering from nerve pain around your knee and you're wondering what you can do at home to fix it? If you are, then this video has the answer for you. My name is Will Harlow and I'm the over 50s specialist physio here at HT Physio in Farnham. And today we're going to be talking about one exercise that you can use to relieve nerve pain around the knee. Now, before we get into the exercise, if you haven't already, please remember to like this video and subscribe to the channel because it really helps me to reach more people who might need my help. If you want to do that, you can find the buttons below this video. Now that we've done that, let's talk about nerve pain in the knee. And nerve pain in the knee is a, a funny symptom because it can be caused by a lot of different things. We have a lot of nerves in the legs and problems or many different types of problems with the different nerves can cause nerve pain around the knee in different locations. So in terms of what nerve pain in the knee often feels like for people, it can either be a sharp pain, often down the outside of the knee or around the front of the knee, or it can be like a burning pain, which just gets worse and worse and worse. It can be a pain that starts in the back and shoots all the way down the leg past the knee. But whatever's causing it, there's always a nerve involved and to cause pain, a nerve either has to be irritated or pressed on and something somewhere has to be doing that. So it's often something trapping a nerve in the back or something trapping a nerve in the hip and you can even get entrapment of a nerve down by the lower leg. Now, in terms of what we can do to fix it, okay, obviously it all depends on where the original entrapment of the nerve is. But there's one area that seems to often give people relief that we can treat, okay, even if the nerve is trapped in the spine or in the hip. And it's an area that I've found to work really well for people who have nerve pain in the knee. So I'll tell you about the kind of people this helps and then we can talk about the exercise. So the people that this exercise can help are the people who have nerve pain on the outside of the knee. Sometimes it can go all the way down the outside of the calf into the outside of the foot. Now, this exercise tends to be really, to, to be really good for people with nerve pain in that aspect of the knee and less effective for people with nerve pain on the inside of the knee, okay? And the reason that it works so well for the outside of the knee is because the area we're going to be treating is down here, okay? So this bone here on the outside of the shin, one that we hardly ever talk about, is called the fibula, and that's what we're gonna be looking at. So to give you a quick rundown of knee anatomy, this is your femur, which is the thigh bone. This is your patella, which is the kneecap. Then you've got your main shin bone here. And when we're talking about the knee, we tend to only think about those three bones. But there's another bone involved in knee function, and that's called the fibula. So it's much smaller. It's a long bone. It goes all the way down to your ankle, and it sits on the outside of the leg. Now, if you can see here, there is a joint here between the shin bone, the tibia, and the fibula. And not much movement happens between these two bones at the best of times. But at the worst of times, you can get almost no movement at all. It can become very, very stiff. And if this bone here and this bone here don't move together very well, that can be a problem. And the reason it can be a problem is because we have one nerve called the common perineal nerve, okay? And it wraps around the fibula right by the joint. So in a normal time, the nerve will move very slightly inside this gap. And when these two bones are sort of moving and they're quite flexible, then the nerve can slide up and down quite happily. But if there's a lot of stiffness here and the bones don't move very well, the nerve often has nowhere to go and it can cause irritation to this nerve, which can make sciatica and other types of nerve pain feel worse. Now, conversely, if we can loosen up this area here, we can bring down some of the irritation in this nerve and then that can reduce nerve pain on the outside of the knee. So that is what we're going to be doing today. I'm going to be showing you an exercise for how to do that in just a moment. It's super simple. Almost anyone can do it. But as with any exercise we talk about on these videos, it's really important that you get checked out before trying these things out. They won't be suitable for everyone. So make sure you get checked out by your doctor first. Now that that's out of the way, let's have a look at the exercise. 
So for this exercise, I'm going to be sitting down or lying on my back with my legs out in front of me. You can also do this exercise sat in a chair because to make it work, we just need our knee bent up like this in a position where we can grab the outside of the leg. Now, for the purposes of demonstration, we're gonna pretend it's my left leg with the nerve pain in the knee, and the pain is often around here and sort of coming down the outside of the shin. Now, to make this exercise work, what we first need to do is we need to find that bone we spoke about earlier called the fibula. And to find it, I just want you to first of all feel your kneecap, then come around the outside of the knee joint, okay? And then if you come down a couple of centimeters, you'll find a knobbly point if you press hard, which is just below your knee joint on the outside. And that is the head of the fibula, which is uh, the lump of bone, which some of the ligaments attach to. So once you've found that, what you're going to do is you're gonna put your finger on it like this, and then you're gonna put the heel of your hand just behind it, okay? So you can kind of dig the heel of your hand into your leg there, it should feel comfortable to do so. And once you've found that area, I want you to just push with the heel of your hand away from you. So we're pushing into the bone. And this is gonna feel weird for you because not much movement happens but you will feel something happening in your leg. You'll feel something almost want to shift and then it gives you a bit of resistance and then you stop. So you push and relax, push and relax. Trying to keep your calf relaxed as well. And you should find that not much movement happens, but you can do this quite comfortably. To show you from a different position, you could also do this sitting down. So how you would do it is you would sit like this with your knees bent. Again, you find the bony point here. You put your hand behind it. You use the heel of your hand here and you just, again, push forward, relax. Push forward and relax. Push forward and relax. And it's as simple as that. You only need to do this for about 30 seconds in a row. If you try and do that three or four times a day, if this is going to work, you will start to feel relief quite quickly. So that's the exercise for relieving nerve pain on the outside of the knee. I hope this video has been useful to you. And if it has, please remember to subscribe and share it with your friends. If you would like more tips from me about things like this, you can pick up a copy of my book. It's called Thriving Beyond 50 and it will give you loads more strategies and exercises and little tips and tricks like this one. You can grab it using the link below this video. Anyway, that's all from me today. Thank you very much for watching and I look forward to speaking to you on the next video.